Hey guys, thanks for watching. So today I just actually got my Avon order in the mail, so I thought I would do like a quick, um, it's not really an unboxing because I tear into everything as soon as I get it, but pretty much just showing you guys what I had ordered. It's some jewelry, it's some fashion, it's some cosmetics that I needed to restock up on. So I just figured I'd show you guys everything that I got. It's not a whole bunch of stuff, but it's a few items, so I figured I'd go over them with you guys so you could see all the new jewelry and stuff that's coming out because I am like a huge Avon jewelry freak, so... I hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. So the first thing I want to show you guys, I'm actually going to be wearing this to work, is this necklace here. It is so freaking pretty in person. It is absolutely gorgeous. And it's got a really good amount of weight to it. Like it's such a nice sturdy um, piece. I really, really like this. So I'm just wearing it with a, a gray and black top today just to give it a little bit of glam and that necklace is called the standout statement necklace from Avon and it's coming into the brochure for $19.99 there it is on the model I have it really really low on my chest because I don't like things to be super super close to my neck but you guys can wear it however there is an extender so and there's the price and that's in campaign 23, which I'm actually in right now. So if you go on my website, it will just pop up. Um, the next thing I want to show you guys is actually from Mark, which is still affiliated with Avon. I know it gets a little confusing, but this is their catalog. But I ordered this. Oh my God, it's a fabulous necklace. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have my necklace form to show you guys what it looks like. I don't know what I did with it, to be honest. But it is so pretty. Yeah, let's show it on the boob. What a blonde moment. <laughs> is that not gorgeous? That is going to be so pretty for, like, the winter. I'll be wearing it everywhere, of course, but... The necklace is going to be $40, and it ca it's called the Iced Cold Collar Necklace, and it actually shows the bracelet, too, and the bracelet is $34. Can you guys... It's gorgeous on the model with her blue eyes. I should do eyes like that. But that's it there. So the next item I got, which are these earrings here, these are also from Mark. These are so different. Like I've never, they're so vintage looking and I think that's why I really like them. I love this. Super, super pretty. I love that dangle. And then the back, let me, I'm really interested in these backings. Let me take it off of the... See the back? Like it's pierced and it has this nice little like clip. Can you guys see this? These are so... They're not as heavy as I was expecting them to be actually. They're not that bad. Uh -huh. And those earrings are called the Noir Essence Earrings, and they're $24 in the, bro the brochure. The next thing that I got from Mark, I was um, really into these new brushes. They do these holiday special edition brushes every year, and I love these because they are so awesome. They wash up nicely. I really, really like the, the colors that they picked for this year, and they are so soft. I love these. This is the one I use for my foundation. It looks so square from being in the box, but my other one's rounded out now. I'll show you what last year's looked like. They had this pattern. They were just pink and like uh, pink and black, I guess, with the silver. See, this is the, it's got my foundation all over it, but I love these. I get them every time they come out now. I think this is the second or third year they've done them, and I love them. Those are actually going to be $30.00 for the set. Can you guys see the, oh there it is. <clears throat> so that's them there in the catalog. They're on the website right now as well. So this is the sweater. I have it in a large because all of Mark's stuff runs like extremely small. But um, it has this gorgeous chain detailing on it and it makes like cute little rattling noises. And it's got the little pockets and it's so shimmery. It's got gorgeous sequins like all over the sweater. It doesn't um, have a closure or anything. You just wear it open. 
and the sleeves are like super super long which I absolutely love if I didn't have a bulky sweater on I'd tie it on so you guys could see but I'll have to take pictures or something and post it another time when I wear it but I absolutely love this sweater so far and let me tell you the price and that sweater is called the chain of command uh, cardigan and it's gonna be fifty dollars there it is right there it looks really cute on her with a pair of jeans too and they have like the cute little flats that kind of go with them but I was going for more of like the uh, rocker chick and I ordered the boots so I'll show you the boots right now let me just find them in here okay I love these oh my god I love boots I'm a huge boot fan it has this uh, really nice like a uh, snake skin effect on them and it has the zipper so you don't have to like untie and retie all the time and I love the buckling they just look so badass when you put them on they have a cute little heel which isn't a lot because I don't like high heels I'm like probably the only chick in the world who doesn't really like high heels I'm more into flats and boots I'm not a big heel person even though I'm super short it's okay I'm 5'4 so um just not a heel person so I love these I got them in a size 8 I absolutely love them oh my god it's love and then here's the other one. Oh my god and then the boots are called army of style boots and they're sixty dollars in the brochure that's them here I love them oh my god I can't wait to wear them um, the next thing that I got was just ugh, stupid. I don't know why I needed it, but I love this kind of stuff. It's just a, um, a cosmetic train case or just a toiletry train case. I don't really travel, so I don't know why I needed this. It's just more stuff for me to have. It's a problem. Anyway, it's got the zipper enclosure. It's pink on the inside. It has the zipper enclosure here for little things. And then you can change this around. It's Velcro. You can change it to however you want. Um, and then that is in campaign 24. And that goes into the brochure for $9.99. See all the stuff they have in here? Like, it's really crowded. So, I mean, it's got plenty of room for things. And then $9.99. Anyway, so then I just ordered some foundations because I needed more foundation. And I like to have a bunch on hand. I ordered one in light beige and one in nude. I usually mix them to get my color. So, because I'm still trying to get rid of my tan, I gotta exfoliate a little more and then maybe get a spray tan or something. I don't know yet. And then I got um, a brow liner in brown because I'm sick of mixing two eye, eye pencils. It's so stupid. So I figured I would just get one in like a dark brown so I don't have to keep filling in with two colors. And of course I grabbed more of my Avon Super Shock Mascara which I can't live without. Although my big and daring I use every day, but this one I use on my lower lash line. And I had ran out of it and stuck the brush in a different tube. But this is what it looks like. Oh my God, where is the writing? Wow, look at this. It's like the printing didn't come off on the tube. Let me open the other tube now and see if it's on that one. That's strange. Here we go with the struggling to open packages. See, this is what it's supposed to look like. Something happened. Whatever. It's not a big deal as long as the brush is good. Let's check it. Oh my god, yes. Okay. But these are just my backups for right now because I'm still using the other one. So I keep those in my uh, mascara tray. Backup tray. It's kind of ridiculous, actually. And then I ordered the um, oh, this stuff I use in the shower. I don't have this, the it comes with the spray pump, but this stuff here I get they have so many different ones that Avon does, but it's a skin so soft, um, luminous like body oil. I put this on in the shower, like after I wash and everything, I'll spray this on and I'll let it sit for a couple seconds and then I'll just do like a quick rinse and then I pat myself dry. And this actually has like little gold specks in it. Can you see that? It actually stays on your skin and you look like you're just glowing all day long. I absolutely love this and you get so much moisture because it's a body oil and you don't feel sticky or anything. It's really, really nice. So that's what I do. Some people get out of the shower, dry off and then spray it on. But to me, that would make me feel a little greasy. So I do it before I get out of the shower. I do quick rinse and then pat dry. It's actually coming out in a whole line. 
like they have here's the mist that I ordered the mist or the body spray excuse me is $5.99 um, the body wash the hand souffle and the body souffle you can get all four for $14.99 rather than paying individual but I, I only needed the one so that is it for everything that I ordered it wasn't a whole lot it was just little things that I wanted and I had seen so um, and things I needed for my uh, makeup stock totally unnecessary but it was necessary for me um, but I figured I'd let you guys know what I'm wearing as of my makeup today but um, this is actually in the outlet right now because they don't make this anymore so they're just trying to get rid of whatever they have in stock if it's even still available I don't know but I absolutely love these and I told everyone on my Facebook makeup maven page to get this if they wanted to duplicate my eye because I love this. They have it in another shade too and I'll grab it after. But this one's called Wrapped Wrapped in Velvet, sorry. And this is what it looks like. I have this color on, a little bit of this brownie kind of gray. I have a bunch of the gray and then a lot of the black on right now. So I'll zoom you guys in so you can see. So I have Avon's Cherry Jubilee on, and let me tell you, it looks super dark on the the, uh, the lipstick stick, but let me swatch it. It comes off so bright. It almost looks like blood on here, wow. But it comes out like super, super not as dark as the stick. It threw me off at first. And then on top of it, I used a, um, a lip brush to apply this because I did not want it all over my face. And that's usually what happens even with a lip liner. It still does that. And then on top, I did a little bit of the mark, which it doesn't even look that dark on here. Why is it? See what I mean? Like they look so different. I think it's more for just shimmer, but... I topped it off with that and then this one is by Mark and it's called Ice Berry and this is actually like one of those magnetic closure tubes which is super nice and it's really little it's not that big see the difference this is the new thing with Avon's uh, lipsticks that I really really like oh watch I'll mess it up but you can see like the color of the lipstick at the top instead of having the look at the bottom so that's everything I got in my Avon box today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments or anything like that for me, please leave them below. I will leave um, down below in the description box um, everything that I mentioned in this video with the prices and where you can get them, which is my Avon website, www.youravon.com slash bsmith7563. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys have a great weekend and a great start to your next week. Bye. I feel like we should redo this whole video. It just sucks. What do you think? Well, I don't feel like redoing the whole video, and people know I'm psycho anyway, so it's quite all right. Write some rules. I like this sweater a lot. It looks like wings. Oh, so should I wear this lipstick to work? I don't know. Kind of like undecided on the situation, but now it's going to be like a pain in the ass to get off anyway. So what were you thinking when you put it on, Brittany? You're either stuck with it for the rest of the night, or you're going to make a mess out of your face trying to get it off. Yep. Mm. This is the dilemma. It's... Uh...